Earth and Twinkle. Today I'm going to share with you a selection of one more and one less resources that we have on the Twinkle website. Let's have a look at some of the activity maps. With this map, children select a number and then find different ways of representing one more and one less than that number. They could make drawings, use counters or gems, use bricks or write the numbers. How many googly eyes will each alien need in each column? Children can use a number line to check their answers. Children could also use Play-Doh to make imprints of one more and one less. They could then find a tool to try and write the numbers in the Play-Doh. Children can do this similar activity using just bricks. Can they make towers to represent one more and one less than the number in the middle? Joining the bricks together is great for their fine motor skills. Seeing the height of the towers changing by one brick each time gives a great visual for one more and one less. They could then represent what they've done in each column by writing number sentences. With these maps you add on detail to the picture and then take one thing away. Children cross out one of the dots to find one less than eight. Can they represent this as a number sentence? You could try this with Play-Doh. Children add on the spots and then squish one to find one less. How many are left unsquished? Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoy the activities.